Number activities in the numbers 200 to 1000 is what we are going to see in this video. Hello viewers, welcome back to my channel PMCE. We are now seeing the learning outcome number activities under the number concepts in class 2. Let us go on to the details of this video to see what are all the number activities we are going to perform in numbers 200 up to 1000. Dear viewers, if this is your first time here, let me give you a quick update on what are all the learning outcomes in class 2 under the concept numbers. Place value concept is one of the learning outcome in which we will be seeing about the ones, tens, hundreds and thousands place. Number activities on numbers up to 1000 is another learning outcome. Comparing numbers and doing problem sums are some of the learning outcome under the number concepts in class 2. I have explained about each of these learning outcome in my class 2 learning outcome video. The link for the same is given below in the description box and also in the iCard section. Place value concepts in numbers 200 to 1000 are dealt with in two videos. The links for the same are given below in the description box. You may click on the links directly and move on to those videos to learn more about the place value concepts. In class 2, actually we will be dealing with 3 digit numbers starting from 100 to 1000. It is split into two phases. In the first phase, we will be dealing with numbers 100 to 200 and in the second phase, we will be dealing with numbers 200 to 1000. In my channel, I have dealt with the first phase 100 to 200 numbers and all the place value concept and all the other learning outcomes for 100 to 200 numbers in separate videos. The links for the same are also given below in the description box. Now let us look at what are all the number activities we are going to perform in numbers 200 to 1000. We will be doing ordering of numbers, after numbers, before numbers, and in between numbers. Let us first begin with ordering of numbers. What do you mean by ordering of numbers? Ordering means arranging numbers in a particular way. It could be in series, in forward or in the backward direction. We could also compare numbers and arrange them in ascending or descending order which will be dealt with in separate video. Let us now do counting in forward. We have been given with a 3 digit number over here, 330. What is the next number after 330? 331, 332, 333. 334, 335 and 336. Let us move on to the next number. The next three digit number given over here is 201. The numbers that come after 201 if you count in the forward direction are, we know after 1 it is 2. So after 201 it is 202, 203, 204, 205, 206, 207. So this is counting in forward direction. Let us do one more example. Write the numbers that come after 983 by counting in forward. So after 983 it is 984, 985, 986, 987, 988 and 989. Now let us move on to the next number activity counting in backward. The three digit number given over here is 702. What is the number which comes before 702? It is 701. The number before 701 is 700. The number before 700 is 699. And 
before 699 it is 698 before 698 it is 697 the number before 697 is 696 let us do the next example 584 is the number given over here we know what is the number which comes before 84 it is 83 so before 584 it is 583 582 581 580 the number which comes before 580 is 579 and 578. Let us do one more example in the counting backward number activity. Number given over here is 666. The number before 666 is 665, 664, 663, 662, 661 and before 61 it is 60. So before 661 you will get 660. Let us move on to the next set of number activities. We will be seeing how to write the before, after and between numbers. Let us begin with before numbers. Write the number that comes before. What do you mean by before? Before means you'll always do a backward counting. I'll give you a number over here and you'll have to do a backward counting and write the number that comes before the given number. So now first let us begin with the first exercise. Write the before number of 720. What is the number before 20? We know it is 19. So before 720 it is 719. Next number given is 449. The number before 449 is 448. The last number here is 200, 200, 200. What is the number before 200? 199. Let us do the next number activity. After numbers. Write the number that comes after. For after numbers, always remember that you should do a forward counting. After always indicates a forward counting. So here I have given you a three digit number. 350. What is the number which comes after 350? It is 351. It is a forward counting to arrive at the next number. What is the number which comes after 808? We know after 8 we have the number 9. So after 808 the number is 809. What is the number which comes after 900? 99. What is the number? The answer is 1000. 1000 is a 4 digit number and we will be dealing with 4 digit numbers in class 3. In class 2 we will be seeing numbers up to 999, 3 digit numbers. Let us do the last number activity between numbers. You will have to write the Number that comes between two numbers. Always remember that to identify the between number, it will be one more than the before number and one less than the after number. So let us look at the example. Here I have given you two three digit numbers 216 and 218. So we need to find out the between number. As I told you, between number will be 1 more than the before number and 1 less than the after number. What is 1 more than 216? It is 217. 
and 217 is 1 less than the after number. Let us do the next example. Write the number that comes between 899 and 901. What is the number which comes after 99? We know it is 100. But here we have 899. So after 899, it is 900. And 900 is 1 less than 901. So between 899 and 901, we have 900. Let us do the last example. What is the number that comes between 501 and 503? The answer is 502. Hope you enjoyed doing the number activities for the numbers between 200 to 1000. With that, we have covered all the topic ordering of numbers, after numbers, before numbers and in between numbers for numbers up to 1000. And dear viewers, as I told you, all the learning outcomes are covered in separate videos and links to all related videos are provided below in the description box. Now, if you like the content of my video, click the subscribe button and also the bell button. Do not forget to choose the all options to get notifications of all the updates that I make in my channel. Give a thumbs up if you like the content and also share it with your friends for whom it might be useful. Do provide your valuable feedback in the comment section. It does motivate me to provide more valuable content in my channel. Thank you for watching my video. See you in the next session with more interesting topics.